So I'm here as uh, Simon's associate today. He's in Iceland, so I'm going to give you a brief look at Marion Methodist. Hope somehow I do this thing right. So welcome aboard, Pastor Mike's video. I am standing on the uh, right at the camera location for our main uh, camera in the sanctuary. Here's what the front of it's looking like. You can see the men down there working on the stairs that will recess underneath the stage. They've got the doors hanging, if you can see uh, there. And of course, uh, over on this side, you see another one of the storage rooms, but you're starting to see the finished paint colors now on the ceiling. You see the lights hanging, uh, that sort of thing. So my video will be a little bit shorter than Simon's, but you can see the curved wall now. The men that are drywalling are uh, getting quite a, long, uh, a ways along in the program. Uh, they'll probably be done uh, Tuesday drywalling. We're going to walk out into the center now and across the way you can see that the uh, window to the kitchen has been painted. That whole wall is kind of a, an agreeable gray. You're starting to see the uh, uh, garnet color that will be across the top of the soffit back towards the front door which you still see and now you see the red wall which will mostly uh, down below uh, that line that you see right there will be covered by wood uh, and you can see the side uh, places where we'll have small groups uh, being formed over here. I'm going to take you briefly into the back uh, entry to the church that leans out into uh, our shed which is being done right now to show you a little bit of the outside work uh, you can see the men working on the dumpster enclosure back there which is a very romantic part of the church that you have to have uh, you can see the fellows working over by the shed but more importantly you can see all these stakes uh, in the, what will be now the west parking lot which frankly friends is what is going to speed us up or slow us down from getting into this building. The rain that is on its way, unfortunately, is going to be our biggest problem. They're starting to clean the uh, overspray from the uh, center here. He's working like crazy. I'm going to walk into the girls' bathroom because I don't think anyone's working in here today. Um, tile on the floor is down. As you can see, uh, there are one, two, three, four, five stalls in this beautiful women's bathroom. The changing table uh, is inserted now into the wall and you can kind of see there's just construction lights in here right now. The uh, sink features, uh, the men's uh, is of course a twin to this and on the other side and of course uh, I'll walk you back into the little boys. Uh, but as I'm walking, you can see now um, that our uh, west, our south, southern doors uh, have been installed. Uh, they're putting some hardware on them right now. You can see a window that's uh, uh, installed there so they can, uh, you can see out to the west and we'll get a lot of structure. Now, I'm going to show you the education building storage room. Uh, in here, there's a room, a window in there. We have 24 windows like this in the education building. Uh, Make a blind in Marion's going to be making some blinds in here, and they'll all be the same, except in the room where the women uh, change for weddings. There, you see a stack of doors that'll eventually be going up, uh, but you can see kind of how that's uh, coming together. Now it gets exciting. Down this hallway, we're going to walk into room 100. Uh, which is a room that's going to be used as a multi-purpose room. Our adult choir is going to be in here. And you can see that the tile and the baseboard is on the floor right now. You can kind of see the uh, accent wall and some of the tile pattern uh, that walks through here. Uh, and uh, kind of fun over here. I'm going to walk through kind of what our finished doors will look like throughout most of the facility. Uh, kind of a walnut looking, uh, actually an oak door, but... Uh, kind of a deep oak stain on it. Um, I was going to walk into the little boys room uh, but somebody's in there working and we don't slow down work because work is not to be slowed down on this site. Here you can see men working on the other room but I want to show you something really fun in one of our Sunday school rooms. This is, uh, I'm going to call it the blue room. This would be a children's room. Look at that uh, tile pattern with the baseboards uh, there. Hopefully I'm not making you nervous from walking. And now you can kind of see the counters. 
going to show you the counters in the uh, nursery because they're completed and they have their sinks in it. No plumbing yet, but uh, they're certainly working away at it. So here you can kind of see what the completed version of our uh, countertops will look like. Uh, this is in the uh, toddler part of our nursery, and here you walk through the half wall, uh, and you can, of course, see the pattern on the floor again, and, of course, the counter in the cupboards. Of course, everything's covered with a little bit of dust right now because it is a construction site. <clears throat> I'm going to walk you down the hall here. Uh, my first Facebook Live video ever, so hopefully none of you are getting seasick while we watch this. Um, the admin portion here at the front of the church uh, building, you see the windows there. They're getting ready to be installed uh, in this uh, orifice here and in the two windows here, uh, which were on the east side of the building now, uh, that will be right across the front of the church. I'll give you a quick look into the kitchen. Lots of workmen in there. Uh, they're doing plumbing, electricity today. Uh, all of our stoves are getting hooked up. The overhead stuff is getting hooked up. You can see the plumbers, electricians working, all that kind of thing. So I'm going to walk you through the front door. It's awful windy outside, but I want to show you two things. Hopefully my voice will uh, overcome the wind. But before I get out there, I'm going to show you. Uh, we have decided now uh, uh, the final details on the cross which should be going up in uh, about a month's time from right now, maybe a little bit less than that, uh, onto the spire. Uh, so I apologize if the wind, wind gets too much, but we're outside now. We're going to put the, spire, the cross on that spire and on this wall over here, where it's really probably blowing, uh, about the same depth out, about uh, eight feet from the wall, you're going to have the uh, uh, three stained glass windows. And then right out the parking lot over that, I think it's the Suburban there or Tahoe, 15 feet from Highway 13 will be the big monument sign that will be installed by Nesper Sign in just a couple of uh, a weeks or a little bit longer, depending on all the outside work, of course, depends on uh, weather. So uh, this is Simon Campbell's uh, associate, assistant, uh, signing off on uh, your Friday video from First United Methodist Church in Marion. Marion Methodist, we're on the move.